If you're trying to lose belly fat, stop what you're doing because I'm about to teach you how to actually achieve that goal. This is a no BS version. I just want to help you feel more in control of your journey because I've been there and I understand how confusing and frustrating it can be with all the mixed information online. So let's get into it. So when we think about our actual midsection, there's two aspects you need to be aware of. There's the actual muscles of your abdomen and the main muscle that we think of when we think of our abs is called the rectus abdominis. This is otherwise known as the six pack muscle. And remember the rectus abdominis is a muscle. Then we have the actual body fat that's covering our six pack. Okay, now rewind for a second. We do know that we can spot target muscle. In other words, if I wanted to grow my glutes, I can train my glutes. If I want to have bigger, more muscular arms, I could train my biceps and triceps. But with fat, as we know, or maybe you didn't know, but now you do, we cannot spot target fat. So for example, if I want to lose my arm fat, training my arms is not going to target the fat in my arms. It's going to target the muscle in my arms. I can train my rectus abdominis, but I cannot train the belly fat that's covering the rectus abdominis. But this is a trap that a lot of people fall into. So whenever you see those posts that say three exercises to blast your back fat or three exercises to melt away your belly fat, you are literally being lied to. People just make posts like this to stop the scroll because they know that it's a common issue that a lot of people are dealing with. And the funny thing is most women spend a lot of their time in the gym training their rectus abdominis, but they don't actually aesthetically in their mind care about having a six or an eight pack. They just want a flat stomach. And a flat stomach comes from losing the belly fat that's covering the rectus abdominis, which is something you cannot actually spot train. And while training your abs comes with tons of functional benefits, like I'm actually all for training this muscle, spending all your time training this muscle or doing it because you think it's going to lead to something that it's not is such a huge waste of your time. So here's what you should do instead if you actually want to lose belly fat. 